uh, doubt in the last one. Invention. Okay, like, please ask. Okay, inversion. It's called inversion. Inversion. Okay, why, why it is called inversion? Mm, okay, I will tell you quickly. Uh, wait a minute. See, this is the typical sentence structure we use. Subject plus verb plus object. And if I make it a little more complex, I can say that plus helping verb plus verb plus object. But if I put the helping verb before the subject, uh, and it will look like this. So what we are basically doing is we are, you know, changing the positions of the subject and all and the helping word. So that's why it's called inversion. You are doing something which is, you know, right opposite of the basic sentence structure. Did you get it? The last one, it is helping word plus subject plus word plus object. That's how you have to frame the sentence. For example, if I say, uh, is he going to do his work? Are peacocks dancing on the terrace? Is monkey eating the banana? Is the monkey eating banana? Right. So here you use the word is at the first place. Then you use monkey, which is the subject. Then you use the verb eating. Banana is the object. Do you understand now? I understand, sir. But uh, I think we make the sentence like the is the monkey eating the eating the banana? Eating the banana. So uh, in this sentence, it's a form of question. You're asking from someone like, hey, is the monkey eating banana right now? Like that's a form of question. You understand? Understand, sir. Okay. Try making sentences from this sentence structures. Like first, you need to complete the previous questions, and if you have time, then only you can try doing it. Uh, otherwise, in next session, we will discuss in deep regarding this concept. Okay. Okay, sir. All right. Well, uh, time to wind it up. I hope you enjoyed the session. Mm -hmm. I'm still waiting for the reply. Did you enjoy it? Yes, sir. I enjoyed. Okay. Thank you very much. Well, uh, make sure you do your homework. Don't forget it. And yeah, even if you do any mistakes and you are not able to form the correct sentences, that's all right. Just try. Okay. You just need to try. If there will be any corrections needed, I will make them. Okay. Okay, sir, I will complete the homework. All right, so well, then see ya. Bye bye. Have a great day ahead. Bye, sir.